Naked, 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 naked. Naked, naked, N-A-K-E-D, but naked. Is it the summertime? Is that why everybody's taking their clothes off in public for cameras, for magazines? Click, 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 stay naked, stay naked. We want you naked. Male, female, we don't care, just be naked. I didn't even know that ESPN had a naked issue. Really? <laughs> okay. And the part that um, either perplexes me or shocks me or surprises me or makes me scratch my head like, what? Remember when Miss America about 15, 20 years ago uh, won the thing and then because she got caught doing some pictures naked, take that crown off, get her off. She's no longer Miss America. It's over. It's done. But now... If somebody wants to market something, you know what? I'm Jessica Simpson. I think since I'm pregnant, I'm going to go ahead and be naked. And then I can talk about my picture. And then I can talk about my TV show. And I can talk about my clothing line. So in order for me to market, I'm going to take all my clothes off and stand naked. And then I can promote my TV show. And I can promote my, my, my clothing line because I'm naked. And I got a pretty body. I got a pretty face. And I'm pregnant. And that will catch their eye. I'm just a genius marketer. It's just so weird how... Time has changed things. Our moral fabric has gone down. And at the risk of talking out of both sides of my mouth, you better believe I'm going to go look at Jessica Simpson. You better believe I'm going to look at those Olympic volleyball players. Ho, oh, I'm 55. They're like 23, 20. Hoo, hoo, hoo. I'm going to check it out. But my point is, if they'd have done that 20, 30 years back, you're going to be kicked off the Olympics. You will not be allowed to participate in the Olympics. We do not accept this kind of moral fiber on our Olympic team. If you feel that posing naked is an adequate, appropriate behavior, you are being banished from the Olympics. Get out and don't ever come back. Now it's like, you know what? We need more viewers for the Olympics. Let's see if we can get our volleyball team to be naked. Volleyball players are sexy anyways. They're women. They're in shape. They've got a beautiful form. And then here's the epitome of the rationale. Guess what? It's done in a tasteful fashion. We're not going to have a spread out eagle like Hustler. What we're going to do is artistic poses and show the body in its form and the muscle structure and the lighting and make it look professional and artsy. That was um, Tyson Chandler's mindset because he said, well, I've seen the ESPN things in the past with the naked issues and it was done very tastefully. I think I'll do it. What did you think they were going to do? Have you hold your ankles and spread your cheeks? Did you think they were going to have you just say, hey, look at the schlong? I'm like, come on. Of course. This is a family magazine. This is a magazine that everybody sees. They've got to hide whatever they're doing naked in some shape, form, or capacity. This isn't Playboy. So it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just crazy the way people make up this rationale on why it's okay to be naked at ESPN because we're covering things up or when she's swimming in there you might see it but it's like a silhouetteish type thing as she's swimming as a naked scuba diver as you're on the cover that airplane issue where the guy you ever seen a grown man naked no just go on the cover of ESPN you see a grown man naked and so that is weird and it's not a big deal because it's done tastefully it's like a modeling Sculpture stood from the side with the basketball hiding the privates and then the chest and the skin and the focus on the tattoos. How appropriately done. He's naked. You see the silhouette of the butt cheek on the right, but that's okay because it's done artistically. And whatever, whatever. You bring that into church and lay that on the pew, people are going to go cuckoo, 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 crazy. Enragement is on the forefront. Arrangement, arrangement. <laughs> it's going to be a holy war so i'm just saying naked still naked it's just that it's 20 years later and the moral fiber has crumbled so diminishedly that it's like okay they're naked we're like france we don't care we love the naked body because we love the naked body because it's done with artisticness and style and culture yeah whatever so, anyways, uh, that's how it goes. That's what's going to happen. So, the ESPN cover is going to have Tyson Chandler on the cover naked. And the Olympics is going to have the very well-formed, athletic, sculpted bodies of the beautiful women naked. And that's how they're going to promote the Olympics. And that's how they're going to promote ESPN. And it's okay because it's 2012. So, that's all i got to say about that. Give us your comments. 
Do you find these ideas prudish? Do you find these ideas go with the times 2012? Do you think that they're rationalizing, that they're hiding their body parts and they're not really naked because it's just like YouTube. They cover and it's no big deal. So what do you think? What do you think? You know what? Our moral fable has gone so far down the toilet that we just have to teach our kids on our own not to do that, not to be naked, not to pose naked, not to go on YouTube and cover up and say, oh, I'm just covering up. It's all a good fun thing. Whatever. So I hope some of that rambling makes sense. I hope the point is think about what ESPN Naked Issues doing. Think about what Ellie is doing with the lady naked on the cover. This is okay now. I'm not saying it's okay, but evidently the FCC and the United States and the moral consciousness has said it's okay now. So what do you think? Give us your views. Talk about it. We'll talk about you guys later. Uh, give us a hit up if you want to do a subscription. Give us a hit up if you want to give us some comments. We want your comments. Give us the comments now. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.